Maloney, Associate Editor of Renewable Energy World. I'm in London at the OSI Soft Users Conference, and I'm here with Chuck Wells. Hi Chuck, how are you? Hi Jennifer, how are you? I'm good, thank you. So Chuck, can you tell me what company you're with and what do you do there? I'm with Pice Energy Solutions. This is a startup company that's wholly owned by Sempra Energy. We started the company to build a new set of technology that can be used in renewable energy control. All right, so tell me, what's the market for microgrids right now, maybe in the U.S. or greater in the whole world? There's several markets for this kind of technology. The technology is actually limited, uh, not limited to just microgrids. It can be used to regulate the grid itself. It can be used in distribution systems. It can be used with distributed energy uh, utility applications on the grid. But for, it was designed initially for microgrids that have a certain characteristic that they have to meet. One of, one of them is to be able to separate from the grid seamlessly and to reconnect seamlessly. And while it's separated, it has to be able to control the, the island grid to within certain tight specifications. So that's sort of a new kind of technology that we believe is important because when you're in an island mode and you have no thermal mass that's providing inertia for the grid, how are you going to stabilize the grid without inertia? So we developed a control system that will allow a microgrid to operate with 100% renewable power. So Chuck, can you tell me a little bit about the relationship between OSI Soft, Pi Systems, and this startup, Pice? Okay, this is a very interesting relationship. Number one is that we recognize that using the Pi system as the infrastructure to handle the data, to configure the data, to allow users to interact with the system, we needed a very strong platform for that. So we selected the OSI Pi system as the baseline system, and we worked with OSI Soft. We entered into the an OEM agreement with them, to, and they allow us to use their platform for these fundamental functions, and then we added the control software on top of the Pi system. This gives us the ability to allow people who are familiar with Pi to interact with the system, and if they have multiple microgrids or multiple applications, then they can use the Pi software to transfer the Pi from this edge processing unit to, to a master Pi server. Okay, so if someone wanted to learn more about Pi's and, and this technology, where could they do that? Okay, we have a website, uh, www.pice.com. That gives you some early information about that. Plus we have a number of publications that people can look at. We have uh, a user conference uh, presentation tomorrow and that will be published. We gave an early presentation of this in the March user conference in San Francisco where we described the technology. I think the important thing is that the technology is useful for, for wind farm control, for solar farm control, and for microgrid control, for distribution system control where you have a lot of renewables that are causing intermittency in the grid. So the key technology that we've introduced is the ability to regulate the grid when you have a high amount of renewable power into the grid. You have highly variable loads, say coming from an electric vehicle charging system, and you need to be able to regulate the grid when you have very highly intermittent loads and very high uh, generation. So that, that's the basic idea. And the interesting thing is the basic technology that we've implemented has been used in other industries. So it's not unique just to the electric power industry. It's used in the paper industry, the steel industry. It's used in the military for pointing guns. So the underlying control theory has been known for many years, but it has not been applied to the electric power industry. They haven't seen the need for it until the percentage of renewables starts to increase beyond 15%. Now they have a difficult time to control. So we've introduced a piece of software that runs with Pi that will solve that problem. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for joining me today, and I look forward to hearing more. Well, thank you very much for inviting me. Thank you.